Hello and today I present to you the movie The A-Team 1983. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they changed in 2023 after 40 years. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us. Alright, let's get started. Number 1, George Papard played John Hannibal Smith in the 1983 film. He was the boss and brains of the team. This Vietnam War veteran was named after the famous Carthaginian general. In addition, Smith was a renowned war scholar, strategist, and always ready for action. His most famous quote is I like plans that go well. He loves to dress up and in his spare time, he often works as an actor in B-rated movies, playing the role of Acuaman, a sea monster. George Papard played John Hannibal Smith when he was 55 years old. Sadly, on May 8, 1994, still battling lung cancer, Papard died of pneumonia in Los Angeles. Number 2, Dirk Benedict played Templeton Face Man Peck in the 1983 film. He is a sophisticated sex symbol, deep-rooted flirt, lover of the good life and refined customs, who is free most reluctant to join the fight. He is responsible for providing the team with documents that are difficult to obtain through the use of a scam. He is an expert in impersonation. Quite independent personality, he sometimes tries to leave the team, preferring to live without risks. Dirk Benedict played Templeton Faceman Peck when he was 38 years old. And now he is 78 years old. And number 3, Dwight Schultz played Howling Med Murdoch in the 1983 film. A mentally ill patient is an adept warplane and helicopter pilot who has flown missions in Vietnam and regularly arguing with his partner Baracus. He was admitted to a mental hospital, but at the time of missions, his companions often helped him escape. Normally he is the one who rescues the team when ambushed, which helps him a lot to avoid being hunted and captured by the army. In some cases, he even appears to be the most alert person on the team. Taste and have the best track record. Dwight Schultz played Howling Med Murdoch when he was 46 years old. And now he is 76 years old. Number 4, Mr. D played Bosco Albert B. A. Baracus in the 1983 film. He is an experienced mechanic and driver. Despite his great strength and evil personality, he is afraid of flying, which causes problems for the rest of the team, who must render him unconscious with drugs, beatings or hypnosis, to travel this way. He does not get along with Murdoch, whom he is always distrusted and often urges to fly off on missions. He often drives a GMC truck, freaks out when someone else does, and wears a large number of gold pendants, earrings and rings as well as a special crest. Mr. T played Bosco Albert B. A. Baracus at the time he was 33 years old. And now he is 71. Number 5, Melinda Coolia played Amy Amanda Tripola Allen in the 1983 film. Introduced in the long-running pilot episode Mexican Slayer Eyed, her character was shown to be short-tempered. However, Coolia soon begins to realize that her character has very little to do. It is known that star George Papar does not like the female lead in the film and has clearly stated his feelings. Coolia asks her character to participate in team battles, suggests Amy try to help, but she gets in the way, adding a dash of humor. Melinda Coolia played Amy Amanda Triple Allen when she was 28 years old. And now she is 68 years old. Number 6, Marla Heasley played Tanya Baker in the 1983 film. Heasley grew up in Beverly Hills and attended Beverly Hills Catholic School until the age of 12, when her parents moved the family to Palm Springs. Her father Jack Heasley and Uncle Bob Heasley are identical twins and professional skaters, known as the Heasley Twins. They skate with Sonia Henney and Dorothy Lewis and also skate in their own ice shows. 
They appear in many movies. Marla Heasley played Tanya Baker when she was 29 years old. And now she is 76 years old. Number 7, Eddie Velas played Frankie Santana in the 1983 film. Velas was born in Manhattan, New York, the son of Puerto Rican. He graduated from the High School of Art and Design and attended the School of Visual Arts. She joined the A-Team in the fifth season before they worked for Stockwell. He seems willing to join them after nearly killing Hannibal, but it is quickly discovered that he works for Stockwell and is forced to join Team A when the latter team works, like him, for retired general. Hess a special effects expert. Eddie Velas played Frankie Santana when he was 25 years old. And now he is 65 years old. Number 8, Robert Vaughn played Hunt Stockwell in the 1983 film. He suggested to Team A, as they were arrested and awaiting trial in the fifth and final season, that they would work for him to in exchange for the drop of all charges against them. Feeling between a rock and a hard place, A team agreed. His personality often collides with them, especially with Hannibal, because of his unorthodox way of acting. Robert Vaughn played Hunt Stockwell when he was 51 years old. Sadly, Vaughn died in a hospice in Danbury, Connecticut, on November 11, 2016, 11 days before his 84th birthday, after a year of treatment for leukemia. Number 9. William Lucking played Derek Lynch in the 1983 film. Lucky graduated from UCLA in Pasadena Playhouse with degrees in literature and theater. In 1986, with co-star Dana Elkar, a native of Michigan, he co-founded the Santa Paula Theater Center. As the co-instructor of the company's freelance acting workshop, he is admired for his minimalist approach, a contrast to Elkar's methodical style. He served alongside Elkar as artistic director for five seasons. William Lucking played Derek Lynch when he was 42 years old. Sadly, Lucking passed away at his home in Las Vegas, Nevada, on October 18, 2021, at the age of 80. Thank you for watching the whole video. If you liked this video please share it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so we can produce more interesting videos. Thank you and see you again.